If you ever tried to remove the front caster wheel assembly, the entire assembly, the whole axle and everything, on a 300, 400, or 500 series rear wheel drive automower, well, you know, it's a little bit of a process because you have to actually split the upper lower chassis apart to get in there to take the push nut off the other end of the axle inside the chassis. And even if for you know some odd reason your wheel just fell out of there or you yanked really hard and pulled it out of there, to get to get back together and stay in there, you got to split the chassis apart and put that push nut back on there to keep it from coming out again. It's a bit of a time-consuming process compared to what you go through with a 115H. And honestly, the 115H, I'm going to set my camera up here so I have my, my hands free to show you this. The, uh, the 115H could not be a simpler process to do to replace the, uh, the front caster wheel assembly. Very simple. And this is all one piece. You can't just replace the tire on this or the wheel. You have to replace the entire assembly. And you don't even really need any tools to do it. There's a tab on this side and a tab on this side. And you can just reach in there with your fingers, with your fingertips, push on either of those tabs, and this thing will pop right up out of there. Just like that. See this tab? This tab right here. And there's one right there on the other side. You just squeeze them together, and it pops right in. And pops right out. There we are. We're in. Out. Put the new one back in. Wait for it to snap and click into place. That's it. That's all you got to do to replace this. And the other big advantage you have um, when you're doing this on your 115H is this whole front wheel assembly here is a little under 25 bucks American, where the uh, the one here for the 300 series, 400 series, and 500 series, um, those two different front caster wheel assemblies, they usually run a little over $40 for a complete assembly. So you save yourself some time and you save yourself some money when you go to do this little bit of maintenance here on the 115H. And there's a better shot of the uh, the two tabs down in there. I don't think I can... Let me see if I can just reach in here while I'm holding the camera and do this. Yep, there we go. Uh, just that easy. You know, it's easier with two hands because you can squeeze these with one hand and pull up on it. But there you saw me just do that with one hand. Just pop that right up out of there. And uh, it's got these grooves here on either side. So you really can't put it in there wrong. You just put it in there. Clicks. That's it. That's all you got to do. So there you are. That's it for your front caster wheel assembly on your 115H. Um, as always, if you're looking for parts for your automowers or you have any questions or need more information about automowers, shoot us an email at roboticmowerservices at gmail.com. If you haven't done so already, be sure to subscribe to our channel. And we thank you for watching.